someone really thought your life was over, but your life has just begun. They're hiding because they're ashamed to admit that. Please scroll on if this doesn't resonate. Feels like you always slip away. The good kind of crazy. They're wondering how you got out of another scrape is what I got. Like, they feel like you slip away from a lot of things. They just don't understand how you keep rebounding. And I don't, here's the thing. This is someone who shouldn't even be questioning it. They should be looking at their own self. <laughs> you know, um, it's like, why are they so worried about what's going on with you? That's, that's the telling part right there. Why do they care? Pretending not to care. <laughs> like I said, why do they care? They're pretending not to. Oh, okay. Grass was not greener, but they do care, obviously. Like, that's the thing. That's what you need to know about this. Uh, they, oh my gosh. Okay, that makes sense. They... It, it's a bit it's denial it's complete denial because they chose some different grass right and now they're pretending like it didn't even happen they want to pretend like it didn't happen they want to pretend like mm. i mean it's like they can't stop looking at you online or even in person you know maybe they even work the building next to you or something and they walk past you who knows i just mean they're keeping tabs on you somehow in person or online and they're hiding because they don't want you to know they they want you to think that they just made another choice and it didn't affect them at all but no no they really okay this is a deeper issue than like probably just somebody walking past you at work unless you just unless you do happen to have a deep you know history with them no this is someone who really it's like goes back a long time ago to where they somebody really over and over again just thought that nothing good was going to happen to you i'm so sorry to say that but it's because it's not true the good kind of crazy like they just thought you were crazy and now they think you're the good kind or they just didn't appreciate you is what what i'm getting they didn't appreciate you. is it over forever oh good oh look you'll always be the one who got away and i'm always curious about you well ain't that the case yeah that's what i'm saying they're always watching you pretending like they're not always got away. okay you'll always be the one who got away it's like you keep reinventing yourself and it's like this person is just a little too overly invested in your life if you ask me <laughs> i just think a busybody like it really this is about them when people talk about you look i want you to if you haven't read it yet it's an amazing book that i read over 20 years ago that i see people talk about online the four agreements by don miguel ruiz and it's about like not assuming what i mean or just there's the four agreements one of them is to never make assumptions because you, you don't want to make assumptions about what any, like about what someone says or, you know, like read too much into what they say because people's minds are chaotic. Like they really, they might say something today that they don't mean and, you know, tomorrow say something else. We're all like that. And anyway, it's, it's what they say about you has nothing to do with, real, with you really. It's all about them. It's their projection. It's how they see life. And um, perfect love. Look at that. Uh, this person... They thought they found perfect love with this grass was not greener. And they're wondering it now with you. That's the deep denial. It's like, what did I do? What kind of mistake did I make? Because uh, all they can think about, like certain things that maybe at the time they didn't like about you. Now they, they love. They have completely flipped. Completely flipped. Any, anything they thought, you know, like saying you're not good enough. No, no, no. You are good enough. Like they, there's just a lot of stuff that this person would say. It was about them. It was not about you. Like, you have gone on. You've done things. Like, I mean, uh, mm, this, okay, their negativity, this is, a, okay, the negativity toward you. Like, I also think that they probably said stuff right to your face before. It's probably, it could be a family member. It doesn't have to be romantic. It could be. Um, could be a family member who just chose someone over you. That could be the perfect love. Seriously. Um, but anyway they know they're wrong now but they're not going to admit it they're going to watch you from afar and even like the compliments that they even think to themselves or tell other people it's not going to come across like like a compliment it's like that, that saying it just went through my head um your enemies will see you walking on water and say it's because you can't swim like that's just who this person has been and tends to be and especially when they don't get their way like especially when something went south with you because i'm telling you they see something of, of the of you and themselves and you've made them realize you make them feel like a failure Oh, yeah. That's what it is. You attract the best opportunities meant for you. Oh, look. You have nothing to hide and you have no fear. Hiding came out with you have nothing to hide. Like, they're hiding from you and you have nothing to hide. You're just out there living your life. And I don't even know. I'm sorry to say this. I'm so sorry because I just don't... Uh, I don't want to speak this. I don't like speaking negative stuff. But I'm going to say, I don't know if you realize the depths of 
what this person has said that that doesn't even matter it doesn't even matter because you have proven them completely wrong you're just all out there attracting great opportunities let's just believe that for you i want you to blindly let yourself believe it have faith like a child that you attract only the best opportunities for you have no fear nothing to hide so i want you to be encouraged that whoever saw you whoever said like they know they were wrong they know they were completely wrong they pretend not to care. Anyway, let's just speak this into your life and draw it in. You attract the best opportunities meant for you. It is spoken, it is written, and so it is. Amen.